got to the track now. First time I get to make use of the VIP parking pass, which is nice, right right next to the paddock entrance, so that's cool. Yeah, we're gonna go get our temperature checked. We're doing that now before entering the paddock, so when I'm walking through, I'm gonna have to put my mask on, so uh, I guess I'll catch up with you once I'm in my driver room. Hey everyone, uh, not sure how good the audio is with my mask on, but uh, so I just got to my driver room. There's a big picture of me on it, so uh, I know which one's mine. So uh, yeah, let's go inside the driver room. I'll uh, give you a little bit of a tour of my home for the next two weekends, let's say. So this is pretty much the same setup that most drivers will have. I mean, you all have the same kind of container. I got three helmets for the weekend, drinks bottles. This is this is the very important section over here. My snack section. Got some goodies in here. Some some peanut butter. I got some Nutella in here now. Everyone knows I like Nutella. The Williams guys just must know me too well. Massage bed, some comfy chairs. And then basically, uh, for all like the debriefs and things like that, normally we would be with the engineers with the intention to try and do a bit more social distancing. Uh, we have kind of the intercom system set up here. So I think as, as much as we can, the debriefs will be kind of online, virtual, so it's just, I can be here in my room and uh, yeah, not have to get too close to, to the engineers. But most importantly, we don't want to get too close to George because I mean, it's George, man. He's always walking around shirtless. Okay, so I got my new mask, uh, so I'm all kitted up, uh, some, some new kit for this weekend. Gonna go into the car now to, uh, yeah, just sit in the car and uh, check out my seats. So normally we will be walking in through this way, uh, but right now that's, it's a one way, you want a way to help with social distancing. So we uh, got to go into the back side. So yeah, basically I'm just jumping in the car. I, I made a, a new seat just to make some adjustments to the one I had in preseason. So now we get to try it out for the first time uh, in the real car. Hopefully it's more comfy. Okay, so we're on the track walk now, getting in our, our first lap, lap, let's say, of the, the weekend on, on foot. So with my race engineer, Gaetan, some more guys from the engineering team, uh, my performance engineers back there, Ronan. Yeah, really on the track walk, we're just looking for any changes to curves from previous years. It's the first opportunity for me and my engineering team to discuss a bit the run plan and, and strategy for, for the race. So yeah, we have uh, quite a walk ahead of us. It's very hot, so uh, let's get to it. Okay, so we just finished FP2, uh, just about to go into the debrief. Uh, we got the intercom system set up here, so all the different channels, the meeting channels, specifically to my engineers as well. So when we want to go into more detail, uh, just with my engineers, I got a separate laptop. Let's use the, the Microsoft Teams uh, software, so another headset here, I can talk to them. But yeah, it's gonna be definitely something to, to get used to, uh, not having as much of the face-to-face -face contact. It doesn't feel uh, as, as easy, it's a bit slower to do, but I'm sure we'll get used to it. Okay, so back at the hotel now. Uh, yeah, it feels, feels great to be back in the car, back driving again. Uh, big smile on my face, going out of the pits and putting my foot to the floor, feeling the speed again, so that was nice. But yeah, overall, it's just super, super happy we finally get to go back driving. Looking forward to it.